I'm Al Wolford, Wolford V Twin Repair here in Providence, Utah. Uh, wanted to talk to you a little bit about cold weather. Don't put your bikes away when the cold weather hits. We've got some wonderful heated gear uh, that I'd like to talk about. Uh, we've sold a lot of this over the years. It's a really good brand. Uh, we have warrantied very little of it. Uh, it's a high quality brand, 95 watts. Uh, uh, when when you put your bike away or when you get it out in the spring you'll ride at least a month to six weeks longer you'll get it out uh, six weeks to a month longer in the spring heated gear is awesome uh, we have coats we have pants we have socks we have gloves uh, everything you need to keep riding a little bit longer uh, the controller that controls the heated gear is kind of like your heater controller in your car you can turn it up as the day cools down you can turn it down as the day warms up. Uh, I carry my heated gear every day of the year. We've been up in Montana, we've been uh, uh, up in Canada on some high passes, we've been snowed on in July and August. Uh, I never go anywhere without my heated gear. Makes the difference between not a fun ride and, and really a nice comfortable ride. Uh, your sweetheart love sweated gear or heated gear if you've got uh, uh, her comfortable on the back she's going to go with you more often if uh, uh, you've got his and hers heated gear top and bottom it's amazing how cool of weather you can ride and we've ridden in 17 degree weather uh, wasn't a ton of fun even with heated gear but it would have been impossible to ride without heated gear heated gear is the bomb great time of year to be thinking about heated gear it just plain works our heated gear is a 95 watt as compared to a lot of others that are 80 watts. Uh, is it hard on my charging system, my electrical system? Absolutely not. Uh, we've got couples heated top to bottom, his and her, uh, and it does not tax your charging system or your electrical system. Heated gear will just plain keep you riding.